Hi, I'm Game Guy. It's time for more Let's Play Pikmin 3 in the past. We're gonna go back here and kill a guy. That sounds fun. Like, watch this go, like, kinda quick, and then uh, the day will end, and yeah. <laughs> That'll be cool. Yep, he's still just kinda there. Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay, well... Let us bring out all of our Pikmans. All of the Pikmans in the world will save the day. I'm still running low on pinks. That's unfortunate. I keep wanting to call them pinks, although I guess technically... I mean, well, they are pink. They're, they're, they're not, like... I don't know. Alf is gonna solo this guy, because... I don't know. Let's regroup there. Okay. Just, I don't know, I feel like less captains would actually help in case I accidentally start throwing captains around. Don't really want to do that, necessarily. Well, I'm losing Pikmin off the bat. That's always a good start. Um, I should probably stay out of the front of this guy. It might actually help in some fashion. Um, okay, so he's going to throw out a pile of something. Everybody needs to, like, run away. It's going to be the fire guy. No, the electricity guy. Should have seen that. Well, I mean, I, I did actually see that, but, you know, whatever. This should, uh, indeed, blow it up a little bit, and now we're gonna just kind of, uh, you know, run around and blow up all your particles, sir. This is gonna be kind of a long boss fight, I can kind of see right now. You need to, like, call back your Pikmin all, like, quick like. I don't like the cube one, because it's gonna, like, try to crush me or whatever. I'm just gonna kind of ignore that one, to be perfectly honest with you gonna wait for him to send out another, I guess. I'm, I'm just not trusting the cube one, because getting flattened is kind of like instant pain and whatnot. This is not good. It's not good in the slightest, dude. Um, everybody get out of whatever that might be, please. And it's the water version. It is the water version. I have an aversion to the water version, I guess. I don't know. Throwing all the Pikmin around is what I do sometimes. Um, ooh, there is gonna be a thing over there. Let us not deal with that cubed menace. <laughs> I'm just not feeling up to fighting the cube, because the cube is a little bit uh, deadly, if you ask me. That is just my opinion on the subject. Let's go ahead and just walk right in front of the guy so he eats me a whole lot. He's not gonna eat me, but, uh, you know... Everybody, get back. Oh, well, I guess he's not actually throwing a thing. He's just absorbing his cube. It's okay, guy. You can keep your cube. I, I don't necessarily need it. But, uh, you know. He's gonna throw out a thing. And now he's gonna fly? What's that about? Um, I'm not a big fan of uh, flying goop. Let's be perfectly honest here. Flying goop is just scary. Unless I just can't attack him until all the flying goop is... Or until the, the thing is gone, I guess. Um, okay. Okay. So what do we have now? A cube. Great! Yeah, I'm getting the distinct feeling I'm not going to be able to do anything until... Um, it comes back down. Dang it, I don't want to go over there because, like, freaking serious. I want this data thing, though. Because let me guess, when it starts flying, send in your wing Pikmin. Oh, oh alright. So wing Pikmin do have a use in this fight. I mean, I, I guess I should have known that, but, you know, whatever. Um, alright, so it's gonna absorb that. Which is fine, that's fine. I don't really want to deal with that, so, uh, you know. Here comes... Another thing. It's gonna be a spire. Alright. Yellow Pikmin, go! Go, yellow guys! You are, like, super fun and whatnot. It's pretty great. Um, alright, so that got rid of a bunch of goop. This seems to be working. I can probably lock onto you, maybe. It, it might help, I don't know. Uh, okay, everybody run away. Oh, my. This is gonna be fun. Um, okay, blue Pikmin on this thing. And on this thing over here. Please break it, because I want to actually, I don't know, accomplish something. 
This is kind of dangerous, maybe, because there's, like, everything everywhere now. We have to smash that thingy, but we're not going to, so whatever. Man, this is gonna get kind of nuts really quick, I can just kind of tell. Um, flying Pikmin, go get him! Ow, that, that wasn't very nice of you, sir. Especially since my Pikmin are just kind of there being sitting ducks, it's great. Hooray, you fell down and left goop everywhere. How rude of you. Of course, you left the goop, like, right in front, so, uh, you know, that was probably a mistake to go after that. Whoops, I, I locked onto you on accident. Obviously, it was an accident, but, you know, whatever. Um, okay, so, fire, get rid of that, and get rid of that. I don't know why there doesn't seem to be a lot of Pikmin over in the fire, but, uh, you know, whatever. Uh, there's a water bubble, let's get rid of that, too. Or not. <laughs> Um, it seems to be almost dead, actually. I'm kind of okay with this. Let's regroup, because I'm losing Pikmin still. Losing Pikmin is not a thing that you want to do on a Thursday afternoon. It's not Thursday, though. Um, everybody come back. Everybody come back. Electric Spire, you are existent. I'm stuck on a wall. That's not good, actually. Um, fire the thingy. You are fired, sir. I have terrible aim. Also, one of my yellows is in there. You're on fire. Yeah, run towards the water. Normally a smart idea, but no. You probably don't want to do that. Um, are you getting, like, close to dead, even? It's losing steam! Go for the body! Okay, sure. I will go for the body. Sure, why not? Oh no, you lost your cube! I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean to, to steal your cube. I just wanted Olimar, and I don't, I don't need the cube. What is the cube, anyway? Is that the cosmic key thing, or... No, that's just Olimar. <laughs> okay. The cube was Olimar all along. I knew that. I knew that already, sir. Hello? That was harrowing. Okay. You're welcome, sir. Olimar, you are captain of the ridiculous ship. Yes, we, we saved Louis. He kind of uh, almost killed us, but you know. <laughs> um, he has a habit of doing that. Well, that's obviously. That's exactly what he did. Uh, please take a piece of this treasure. Conveniently, the thing that I need. <laughs> Hooray! We done did a thing! That is a relief, indeed. This must be fate, Captain Olimar. Octate is on our way home, so why don't we give you a lift? Your own ship is sadly out of commission. Well, that is unfortunate, sir. Nobody liked that ship, anyway. Oh, hi, Louie. You're here, apparently. <laughs> Can we just leave Louis behind? I mean, we, we did it once already. I, I think he knows what to do. So is this the part where we leave? Aw, we're leaving the Pikmin behind. Well, okay. Why are you there again? Like, seriously, why is that gold thing there again? Like, didn't I kill you? Why are you... Why are you back? Bye, guys! I'll be back for the post-game, don't worry. <laughs> Seriously, why is that guy there again? I, I just killed him. Unless there's another one, which kind of, you know... I don't... It kind of defeats my victory a little. Just saying. You think they'll be okay without us? Nope, they're all dead already. Because that gold guy, just he just came down the tree and he's like, Hi! I'm going to eat you all now. Let's go home. Preparing to enter cosmic speed! Oh, it sure is a good thing we have that thing. Yay! We're going to go save the world. Well, that's cool. Explorers managed to secure a modest supply of edible matter for their oh, home planet. Satisfied. The explorers oh. managed to secure a modest supply of edible matter for their home planet. 
Yet still they wonder, can this handful of seeds really bring salvation to the people of Kopai? Nope, we need more. Even if they carefully cultivate the seeds they've harvested, it may not be enough to support the entire population. This thought hovers over the explorers as they embark on their journey home. Along with their cargo, they carry with them a sense of unease. But then they ejected it into space and everything was fine. Not the cargo, the, the sense of unease, because, you know, you can totally do that. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure that's totally possible. Oh man, credits! I actually did beat the game. I wasn't entirely sure if that was the end. I, I'd, I'd say that was a fitting final boss in a way. I mean, it kind of made you use, like, every type of Pikmin. So, you know, that, that does actually kind of make sense, you know? <laughs> well, um, this game! <laughs> Gotta say, I, I do think it was quite worth it. Uh, it's, it was quite the game. I mean, I, I was a little concerned because people had said that the game was a little short. And I suppose it would be if you know what you're doing. Whereas I obviously didn't really. Well, it's not that I didn't know what I was doing. It's more that I didn't really know where to go. No, Red Pikmin, you cannot get that butterfly. For you are not a flying type Pikmin. You are a fire type. Oh, they're going down the slide. Yay, that's fun. That is fun. No, this game, man. Like, I don't I don't know where I would place it in comparison to Pikmin 2 just yet, simply because I obviously... There's going to be a post-game. I know there's a post-game, because we're going to go back and get more fruit or something. And there probably is another area. Oh, yeah, you guys better hide in those flowers. Yellow Pikmin, you might want to... Okay. Yeah, you might want to hurry. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. You, you're going to have to, like, eat the entire flower. Oh, but you're not going to do that because you're lazy. Okay, well, you know. This is kind of a silly little ending. It's just showing the Pikmin surviving. Yay! Oh, <laughs> well, you gotta watch out for aerial attacks, I guess. Granted, swooping snitch bugs don't actually kill you. They just throw you in the ground for some reason. Oh, the Pikmin are singing. That's cute. Look at him, climb up the thingy. Yeah, so, no, this game was pretty darn good. I, I like the emphasis on, like, objectives rather than just simply collecting treasure all the time, I guess. It was kind of a neat change of pace a little bit. Seriously, you guys are singing, like, all over the place. Kill the dragonfly! Get the nectar! Rawr! Yeah. Happy end, right? <laughs> right? Uh-oh. That looked... something. Hmm. Wonder what that could have been. I indeed wonder what that could have been. The... not end. Let's be perfectly honest here. <laughs> Although I will say, something that wasn't really explained, at least not yet, is why Olimar and Louie are here in the first place. Obviously they came back for, like, treasure or something, which kind of fits them, I guess. But, um, like, why? Like, the company wasn't in debt, or at least it shouldn't be anymore, unless they just spent everything. But, um... I, I, I don't know, man. I have no idea. I got 26 out of the 66 fruits. And um, I lost a, a whole bunch of Pikmin all over the place, actually. Um, yay, that was, that was fun. The best five. Look at me, I'm number one, guys! I'm the best! Heck yeah! Rankings, what is rankings? Fruit taken back. Oh, man. Um, I don't know why this is... Like, all the way here, but... What's up with this, exactly? I, I don't really know. I'm not sure what this is supposed to be. Oh, fruit and days? Uh, days needed to take all 
fruit home. What, is this like an estimate? Or No, these are global rankings? Wow, it took people like 50 days approximately to get all the fruit? Huh. <laughs> okay. Well, it seems like a majority of people actually have all the fruit, so that's that's cool. I'm like way down here. I'm this little, little tick here at the bottom. Okay. I'm pretty good at video games, guys, <laughs> in comparison to other people. Oh, we're just going back to the title screen now? Well, okay. Um, yeah, so that was a thing. I guess the story mode is done. Main game, anyway. Let's be perfectly honest. I'm going to go back and get some fruit. Um, I guess next time we're going to start the post-game, no doubt. Um... Mission and bingo battle mode, I'm just going to leave for my future self to do. I'm going to kind of do those on my own. So, in case you're wondering about those, figured I'd point that out. I might record it, I might not, I'm not actually sure how I'm going to do that. But I'm not going to be, like, full-on commentating everything like I've been doing here. Because I've been doing that, you know? <laughs> so, uh, yes, next time, post-game. See you later, boy.